in pre-season end. It's a one nil defeat to Arsenal, but it wasn't a bad performance at all. How are you feeling? Yeah, it was good. I mean, to be fair, from the club's point of view, it's a fantastic evening, first and foremost. I want to thank, obviously, Arsenal Football Club for for coming down tonight. We had a few problems early on, but they they were very good the way they reacted to to the situation and obviously turned up. And I think you see tonight, there's some fantastic players there, some stars for the future. And I just think the goal just... Um, really capped the evening, to be fair. It was an unbelievable, unbelievable goal. Unbelievable in the terms of what he was looking for and the way he finished it. And full credit to them. We had a lot of opportunities there, especially late on, to get something out of it. It just wasn't quite good enough. Yeah, but you, you managed to get a lot of the squad playing games. You brought in a few of the youngsters from the academy. Pre-season ended. Are you happy with what you've seen and where you can be on Saturday? I just think, you know, I just got to sit down now with the coaches and just and probably just go through one or two things. We've got to, we've got to go and work on some set pieces um, for and against. To be fair, you know we've, we've defended better today for from set pieces, even though they or we knew they weren't going to be thrown in the box like Chelmsford might do on Saturday. Um, but some of our free kicks were, were very good. We've had a couple of chances um, just late on. We picked some poor options out, um, but they're all things that we work on now going into the last sort of five days before. For Saturday, so are we where we are, where we want to be? We're not far off. I think some performances have been very good. One or two performances have been a little bit in and out, a little bit indifferent. Um, but pre-seasons like this, and uh, we'll obviously know where we are once the season starts on Saturday. And obviously, you did have a goal in the net. Didn't look too offside from where I was. I'm not sure where you. Are. Obviously, neither of us are as level as the Lino. It's pre-season though, so there's no points to dwell on. So are you happy that the chance is being created? And there were quite a few that went very close as well late on. We've had a couple of games this year where we haven't created the amount of chances we wanted to, but um, certainly on Saturday and certainly again today, we've created a number of chances. Um, I think the one the one thing about it, we haven't we haven't taken them chances and scored goals. And in games of football, you have to score goals to win games of football. We haven't taken any of the probably three or four chances we've had tonight, and, uh, and one or two of them were you know in that situation where we should be scoring. Um, but we haven't hit targets. Um, but hopefully you know, that will change on Saturday, as I say, when we go to Chelsea. Obviously, like you said, big day for the club. 2,600 in here. And that terrace behind the goal was really rocking. And if you have that support all year, how big is it that you make this place a fortress when we come in? I think it's massive. We see that last year. We've said all along is that the, the people of St Albans have been turning up, especially uh, from, from probably the second round of the FA Cup when they started to turn up on the Tuesday nights. We've seen the crowds grow week in, week out. And you've seen again to tonight, you know, 2,600 on a Monday night here. Um, it was a fantastic turnout. Um, and what's been going on with football over the weekend, obviously with the Lionesses, which was a fantastic achievement. For them to turn up here tonight and, and show their appreciation um, was fantastic. You know, we, we, as I said all along, we've had great crowds at this football club. The, the supporters have been outstanding. And we've got to try and keep them. We've got to play attractive football. We've got to win games of football and we've got to try and keep them here for, for the whole of the season because it's important to the club um, and it's important for the players because you know they do want to play in front of a big crowd. Yep, thank you, Ian. Cheers, Will.